Okay, Trav, look, we're all happy you're in love and all, but we got to talk about, you know, the mere eight catches for 69 yards and all of that. I'm not worried about, you know, the catches and the yards and, and all of that. All right, so don't worry, be happy, Chiefs fans. Travis Kelsey on his podcast addressed his slow start and said... We're winning, and that's good enough for me. I have the most fun when I get the ball thrown my way. I mean, who does? We're 3-0, and man. It doesn't get any better than a 3-0 than a, than a and start. Is anybody buying that? No. no. It's no. good enough for me. No, it's like you're part of the team. You're a star player in the team. When you're winning, it doesn't matter. I think it's fair to question how dedicated he is to football. He's jet-setting all over the world with the most famous person in existence. When is the last time that we saw him jet-set? He flew from Missouri and went to New York for a tennis match. He saw Patrick Mahomes there, too. But Patrick's good. If you can do it, jet-set and play well, then no problem. And if you can jet-set, play well, and bang Taylor Swift, then even better. It's like the trifecta. I can imagine that you're frustrated. I've had a lot of catches in this league, man. Absolutely. Just not lately. But don't sweat it, Trav. We're only three games in. You'll get your groove back. But yeah, for now, maybe you're spread too thin. Courtney, you're the sort of person who can drink and party and then come into work the next day. He's not. I don't do that, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you on the field Sunday, Travis. We're expecting great things. As long as we're winning football games, we good to go, baby.